No, they really just arrested, I think, the house owner. They arrested two people. For what? Because of being loud? He didn't have his ID on him. He's 22. They just arrested him for not having his ID on him. He lives in the house. It's his house. For not having an ID? He didn't go inside. They just took him out. How fucking believable. It's uh, 3186. <laughs> This is uh, JP from socialvertigo.org. This is this is a uh, on the scanner. It said this was a noise complaint, and uh, three arrests came out of this. And one of them was because some guy refused to give him his ID. Yeah. It's not worth the promise. Yo, promise is not worth it. It's not worth the promise. Oh, let him lock you up, man. I'll help you file the lawsuit. All right, thank you, man. Yo, promise is not worth it, man. Just leave it. Promise, they won't change their mind. Let's go. He took him like this. It doesn't matter, dude. He lived there, though. Dude, they got badges. They think they can do whatever the fuck they want, man. It doesn't matter what you say, man. He's getting wallet to take him for no reason. That's some bullshit. I'm press. You can mind your own business. I'm press. Mind your own business. You're not even allowed to talk to me. I got a complaint on you, so shut up. Oh, 
I don't know what to tell you. Thank you. Yep. He doesn't have to give you anything, dude. Fucking douchebags. Dude, the more you talk, the more you incriminate yourself, dude. Just don't talk to him. Dude, it's guy, all in the huh? Keep doing your shit, bro. Yeah, thanks, bro. I appreciate it. Keep the camera rolling, it's JP Social Vertigo. He invoked his Fifth Amendment, didn't want to talk, and didn't want to give his information. That's why. Yeah. A natural giving right. That's what he got arrested for. I know, but our coach is tough. Is our coach good? Dude, our coach is hot. Let's go. Let's go. No, I know that, but like. Yeah, you really like to be heard, don't you, Lieutenant? Yeah. 
Hey, verbal notice to quit. Stay away from me. Fucking douchebag. Dude, don't talk to them. The more the information you give them, the more they use. Don't talk to cops, man. What's going on, Doug? Social vertigo now, man. Yeah. Different website now. What's going on here? Party right here at this house. One of the uh, one of the guys, one of the dudes there partying. Yeah. Didn't want to give his ID and in inf any information, so they arrested him. He invoked his Fifth Amendment right and got arrested for it. I know, but it doesn't matter. When you guys came in, you talked to him, right? Like, just everybody out. Did he do that? No, the cops came in. No, it was early. They came by. They drove by earlier. I don't know if they stopped or not. I heard they did, yeah. They, these guys are upset about the cops showing up. They don't understand that they got badges and they don't give a fuck what they have to say. Don't talk to cops, man. Don't have conversations with them. Don't share information from them. Don't share them your view. They will use every bit amount of that against you. And they're sitting there chatting with them. They're not your friends, man. Right now, they're being file cabinets. That's what they are. They're walking file cabinets. Peace, man. I'm just trying to say it is, there are offense in the future, like, try to be a listener, you know, we're kids, you know, but try to be a listener, you know, that's, I knew that was true, I respect that, I respect that, don't talk to him, man, stop talking to him, how is that witness so credible, that's the only witness like that, no, I don't think that, because that's our friend, I know it's our friend, no, it always goes like that, it always goes against, what's that, man, always, that's not gonna happen, dude. Sorry. When there's cops here, I'm video recording them, whether you like it or not, bro. Sorry. It's for your safety. Trust me. What if he pays it? What if? What if he did? What if he did? But without like taking people. We know that something happened. All the details. But they come next to it. I know, but before we have the cops. It's not that we can just assume it. But the details are next to what happened. This is JP from SocialVertigo.org. These guys just got broken up for the party. If you notice, it was like seven cops there earlier on the video. There's still two there. And they broke up the party. Groups went that way. Groups went that way. And groups went this way. These, these, this little group here is the most upset about it because it's their friend that got lugged. Uh, ended up getting arrested for not giving his ID, and he didn't want to give his information, which he has every right to do on private property. He wasn't under suspicion of a crime. It was a, a noise complaint, basically. You know, a victimless crime. How you doing? Make sure no one's still in there. I know, but like, I don't. I just don't want to sell my coach at this point because he's gonna kill us. We'll talk to him. We'll talk to him. I do care. We'll talk to him. All right. We're good to go to the cop and make sure nothing's going on. It's not, it's not them, it's the same officer that talked to us last year. I know, it's, yeah, it's not us. I'm, I'm really pissed about that whole situation. I know, but it's just been it. written down. Yeah, that was all that could have happened. We, we, we violated we, it, that's we fine. Can't, we we can't do anything if that's right. Do you understand what I'm saying? They asked for his ID. He's going to have a good night. We don't know what to do. Let's go. Let's go walk around and see what's going on. We got to keep.